Hey guys, welcome back. So, raiding in 2021, it's, um, uh, yeah, I don't know. I haven't done it in like a year, so I don't really know what to expect anymore. But <laughs> from from what I remember, everybody used to always stick a Megatronus on Robot Resource, like right in the middle or in the beginning. Basically, one of the nodes where you're forced to fight him, and it was super annoying. And um, yeah, that was honestly the toughest fight. There are a couple people that had Scorponok on the tech console, which we would always, always, always just heal a ton. And that one was super, super annoying. But for the most part, I think raids are generally pretty straightforward and easy. Uh, I did take out Megatronus. I think I used them for Alliance missions and I stuck my Scorponok in there. But yeah, usually I have my, my Megatronus there, so. Let's actually take a look at raids and see what uh, what has changed. Honestly, I don't even come in here anymore, so I don't... Okay, so today they still have the three-star uh, signature upgrades, so those are... Okay. <laughs> a three-star bot crystal for 40. Yeah, okay, so the prices haven't changed. I remember these prices are still pretty much the same. 5,000 for one of these, 40,000 for a three-star bot crystal, and then... Oh, okay. So this one's actually... Okay, so this one's um, <clears throat> metal locked, I guess. So you need at least 1,700 metals to be able to get this. It's expensive for a tier 3 class spark crystal. I would think that'd be for like a 4 star, but it's for a three, uh, tier 3. Sorry, I was thinking for a tier 4, but oh well. I don't know. Let's see. What do we have here? We have a... Ooh, your fat mama. I guess it's only uh, fair that we go down, that we fight against him. Kickback has always been one of my favorites to bring along on, you know, these particular uh, fights. So throw in kickback and what else can we use? Who else can we use? Let's go ahead and use, we'll use Soundwave and we'll go with one more, I think Primal since every now and then, um, well actually I don't know. Who's immune to bleed? Do I have my Grimlock anywhere? He's only rank two? Or rank three? I need to take out my Grimlock, man. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, who do we want to take? All right, I guess we'll just take Primal <clears throat> for the Harm Accelerator lanes, because there's always one. There's always one, so it's it's a good idea to bring characters that can counter that. And of course, the first we do have a Wheeljack that is on Harm Accelerator. So let's see how it goes. Honestly, I don't know how it's gonna go because <laughs> I can't purify that initial harm accelerator so i'm just gonna keep taking a bunch of damage so i probably should have brought grimlock but oh well it is what it is uh this guy does have a wheel jack we'll see if he's a nano jack he is one tick he's one ticking but it should be fine kind of wish i would have brought my um definitely grimlock or like a beast Warza team just to purify. I'll just keep baiting everything out. Should be pretty easy. I hate this this lane, man. If you don't have somebody that can purify, you're basically forced to eat all this damage. I do see a lot of people either have, um, you know, they put their wheel jacks on this node. bait out that special. I did not dash on that one. I don't know what this game was thinking. Come on. Use your special. Okay, not bad. Here we're gonna go for our 27% man. That is so dumb. He does have a really strong wheeljack though. But Oh well, let's see. What can we do here, guys? Can, we, can I land at least one? There we go. Awesome. I landed two, but it's fine. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm like fat fingering my dashes sometimes. I feel like I am. There we go, after three minutes, <laughs> we were able to take down their wheeljack. 
Let's see if the rest of them can go by a little bit quicker. He does have a EMI mod on his... Dude, this guy has every single bot like fully maxed out. Jeez, he's been working on them. Does he even play anymore? Probably not. <laughs> his metal count is pretty low. Pretty much like mine. He has a really good team though. Dang. Alright, we'll fight this Optimus. I don't feel like going down and dealing with that um, hound over there on the on the right hand side. Let's see. Need to land. Need to land just one heavy. <laughs> That's all I need to land. Just one heavy, then we can get the power gun going. There we go. I'm power gaining really slow. Actually, this is regular, right? This is normal sound wave speed. And then we just drop the special two. Gotta bait it out. Super easy. <clears throat> just go for the dash, go for another special two, and we're just gonna rinse and repeat, basically. <laughs> I don't really wanna spam heavies either, because sometimes they do miss against this Optimus, but. It's just safer just to wait. I do still want to attempt um, Legends of Cybertron 3 guys and go down all the other paths that I never fully explored. But I do want to wait on that until Kabam officially announces what they're going to be bringing to the game for the anniversary update because I don't know, I feel like it'd be super pointless if I if I'd completed it and then they dropped the anniversary and then it's like Oh, Legends of Cybertron 4 and rank 6 bots and that's it. It's like, what? Nope. Nope. Not doing it. I am not doing that again, so... Uh, we'll see what they have planned for uh, April, which is coming up soon. Just a few more months. And this is why you bring the pack. Just completely eat away at that, uh, that resource mod. Plus, you can apply those power leaks, which are amazing. Here we go. Let's go ahead and land a whole bunch of them, plus the bleeds, which always, always, it's always super nice. He might die. Oh yeah, he's gonna die for sure. So there we go. Quick and easy win. This map makes like my screen look all yellow. <laughs> my reflection. Uh, okay, so here we have an Optimus that is on that armor mod. I think it's armor module. Security module? Security protocol. That was close. That was close. I almost forgot. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, sound wave sounds pretty good against them. <clears throat> we'll try doing two raids, guys. After this one, I'm going to switch out my primal for somebody else. Okay. Now here we just beat it out. Honestly, your raids are super easy. It's just uh, an extra way of getting little rewards. I think in the beginning, though, Kabam had like a pretty good idea going with like raids. The fact that you could attack somebody else's base and all these things, but I feel like it just stagnated. I feel like there's, they could have gone a whole different route with raids, but they didn't really do anything. So, yeah. And in these exclusive mods as well, they never like officially release them, and I don't even think you can take any mods at the moment, any four star mods up to like rank four. So stupid. This goes to show how like incomplete this game is. And lack of updates and content. And okay, he's got six armor buffs. Crazy. I don't think I would kill him if I use my special two. It's like super tanky. But, oh well, we should do it. Sound wave for the win with this special two. And up next, last but not least, we do have a barricade who is on. Don't remind me. Uh, what is this one called? <laughs> it's the one that crits. It's the one that can instant. Uh, Knight's fury. Knight's edge. Something. Knight something. Nightbird's coal. There we go. I'm so out of touch with this game, guys. I apologize. Yep. Strike a lethal blow instantly against opponents below 9% health. I love putting Prowl on this one just because you can insta-kill people. So he's pretty good. I think I think 
basically a lot of the scouts are, would be really good on this uh, on this mod. But we'll go ahead and use barricade. Kick back against barricade. Let's see what we can do here. <laughs> Don't let ourselves fall below uh, nine percent. I think we'll be good. Okay, why am I not landing anything? You got teeth, cog, sir. Cog malfunction. And I am gonna go for a special here. Get some shocks going. Let's see. Can we do one more key clog? Yep. Alright. I'm just gonna hold it, bait it. See if he wants to use a heavy. Nope. Alright, I guess not. And that is gonna be it for Barricade, so not bad, pretty easy. Let's see what we stole. <laughs> so we ended up stealing 97,000 in total. Well, we stole 57, but we got... How do we get so many if the victory only gives... Oh, okay, my bad. The total is, I guess, the amount that I have in total. That makes sense. We stole about 60... Close to 70,000, so not too bad. Let's try one more. Um, this is one with the Megatronus. I kick ass. I guess we will face him. This dude probably has a whole bunch of characters as well. Fully, uh... Oh, wait, okay. I was gonna say, did I forget to switch characters? Um, I forgot who's can purify. I know Grimlock can purify, but... You know what, screw it. We'll go with this team again. Of course, Megatronus. <laughs> and of course, uh, he has a wheeljack as well that's on that uh, that node. Well, kickback has always, has never really failed me when it comes to fighting Megatronus. I do need to get a heavy really, really quickly right off the bat. So hopefully we can uh, get this heavy. There we go. And then we can apply some power leaks one power leak there's three power leaks so not bad I'm pretty good with the power leaks <clears throat> the tea clogging. no 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 oh wait yeah I keep, no I don't even know what happened there I was gonna say oh we're good, we're good, we're good. We're avoiding almost everything, so. Not too bad. Uh, I can eat some damage here. <clears throat> I hate that he, uh, he powered in such an insane amount. Okay. But, we're good, we're good. It was a little close. I was, uh, I was kind of worried there. I was getting a little bit worried. I was like, dang, is he really gonna get up to a special three? But no, we, uh, I think we, we did pretty good there. I'm gonna save this um, fight. I'm not gonna use Primal, just in case I mess up. And then we have to go fight the Wheeljack, who's on Arm Accelerator with no way to purify anything in case I eat another you know, tick of damage. So we will sacrifice. We won't sacrifice. Sound wave to just defeat Drip. Just playing it safe, guys. Avoid that. Go for the special two. And whip the dash a little bit early on it. That's fine. I feel like my sound wave or sound wave in general still doesn't really do that much damage. His little buff, it helped him a little bit, but I feel like, I don't know, he still seems underpowered to me. His power gain is amazing though. Okay, so Wheeljack again. <laughs> I hate these Wheeljack fights, man, but the more annoying fights are the ones where uh, Wheeljack has that. Uh, 
nano repair. Is the shield alive? Okay, not doing too bad. Let's see if these can push them in. There we go. <clears throat> got a good, got a decent bleed off. Gonna bait this out, and then we're, we are gonna be good, guys. Don't let him construct. Don't let him construct. Ah, okay. There we go. It's fine. Deep wounds for the win. <laughs> Special one with the bleeds. So not too bad. He does have a Necrotronus. We could go down that lane. Do we want to risk it? Sure. Let's fight the Necrotronus. Gonna go ahead and use my. Yeah, we'll go ahead and use Primal. Should be fine. Laser guidance module, okay. Let's go for heavy. Nope. Swing and a miss, primal. <laughs> Swing and a miss, okay. I need to push him into a special too. I still have trouble dodging the special one. I've never really like fully uh, took my time to like practice how to dodge it. So yeah. Uh, there we go. Okay, good. We're good. I was thinking, I remember this dude power gains a lot when he drops either below 20 or 10. I guess it's under 10, and then, yeah. You just gotta be really careful, but we're good, not bad. This guy has a prowl <clears throat> on another robot resource. Annoying, yes, super annoying, guys. Uh-oh, 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 okay, we're good. Need to land some power leaks. I think we'll be good. Yes, yes, yes. Wheel jack. I mean wheel jack. Kick back. Land those power leaks. Ow. Hate being stuck in the corner. He's not even doing anything, he's just standing. I need to use my special on you, Prowl. Okay, there we go. This should kill him. I think deep wounds, yeah. There we go. That sound, man. I think it's still one of my favorite, like, sound animations in the game. Kickback special too. The wings just smashing against the opponent. Uh, but okay, that's uh, raids, guys. Raids is still what it is. Boring. <laughs> Boring, just run it down, defeat everything that you can, and bring your strongest characters, deal with some annoying mods. It's still the same, hasn't changed a bit, so. Can we expect to see maybe a refresh, maybe an update to raids? Probably not, I don't think so. I mean, I would, I'd honestly be glad if they just got rid of it altogether, but this is a tiny way of accumulating gold and getting some extra resources through the raid store, so I'm sure they'll keep it. I don't know, know if they plan on releasing the requirements to update some mods. Probably not, because, you know, kabam, and, you know, because Forge to Fight. <laughs> but if we come in here, upgrade, we never did get these, these tier 3 offensive sparks. It says, what does it even say? It says, use offense sparks, find more by participating in alliance missions and events, but... Alliance missions doesn't give anything. <laughs> yep. Nothing related to that. So, yeah, another lie, another letdown. So, yeah. Well, let me know your thoughts, guys, on raids 2021. What you guys would like to see maybe changed with raids. I honestly would just like to see them completely go away, but it's not going to happen. Uh, but I don't know. 
uh, maybe what I was thinking always I thought of in the past, I guess, um, was maybe adding more of these nodes that you can add to like your base and just have, you know, a ton of characters on your, on your field. I don't know, collect a whole bunch of gold, but that was back then. Gold isn't really an issue, I think for, well, I think it is still an issue for new players, but I don't know. So many things can change, so many ways that they can go about this game, but who knows? We'll find out though in April, <laughs> as we approach April. But thank you for watching, have a good weekend, and I will catch you all in the next one, which would be Thursday. Sorry, let me stand still because my camera is like getting super blurry, my bad. <laughs> I will catch you on the next one this Thursday, we should have a new uh, time slide, yay. So we'll get some more info on that. But uh, have a good weekend, guys. Stay safe, and I'll catch you all later.